Okay, here is another question. Um, very similar, just a little bit different here and there. So they all, it's October, November 2016. So they always give you all the uh, very interesting chemicals. You, it's, it's, it's the same thing, same method, just the chemicals that might change here and there. So before we start, it's good to recall the three important formula, mass over molar mass equals the number of moles. So whenever grams, use this. If it's the gas, volume of gas, use this. Whenever you see concentration, you use this. Whenever you see mole per dm cube, use this. Make sure this is a capital M. Okay, come on, let's start. So they say chlorine, bromine, and iodine are halogens. So we can revise a bit. Halogens are group 7. So chlorine can be made in a lab, heating manganese, and they give you the equation. Once again, before you start, it's good to write the ratio. 1 ratio 4, ratio 1, ratio 2, ratio 1. How do you get the ratio? Use the number in front. Okay, so then I say calculate the volume of 8 mole per dm cube of HCl. So 8 mole per dm cube, when you see this, put a capital M. Okay, needed to react with 3.48 grams of this manganese oxide. So you can put, when you see this, put a small m. Okay, so this is the question. Usually it tells you that, oh, after finish all this step, you get the volume. You see, volume HCl, volume HCl. Okay, so you just follow their question, follow what they need, and then you get the final answer. So uh, moles of this MnO2. So moles, so you put N. So then look at it. Oh, so it's given this, the mass here, and then N. So how do you relate? Recall this. Okay, grams, use this. Okay, so then uh, put in 3.48. Then uh, molar mass or relative mass are uh, these. You have to use a periodic table. Mn. Mn, 55 here, 55, okay. Plus O2, oxygen, then use a calculator. Usually put a bracket. So 0 0.04 mole, okay. So you see mole, they give you even more tips to tell you that, oh, you need to find mole. Okay, done. Then number of moles of HCl needed. So since you have this at 0 0.04 mole, so you see, from using the equation, jump from one chemical to another, you have to find HCl. So 1 to 4, 0 0.04, then you need to times 4. You can always use the calculator. 0 0.16 mole. Okay, so very easy, 0 0.16. Mode. So you want to do the show the calculation, it will be good. Okay, so that's how you go from one chemical to another. Now the last step, volume of HCl. So oh, volume, V, okay. So what else is given? HCl, the M. So whenever they give you capital M, concentration, and you want to relate with V, you can always recall this formula. Okay, so I'll write this down. Okay, since we have the volume of XL, oh, we need to find the volume. So then the number of moles, so we have is 0 0.16. Okay, then the concentration, 8. Okay, so we rearrange this, V equals to uh, times over. Okay, divided by 8. Okay, simple mathematics. So you got 20. So then you'll be asking, oh, what is it? Cm cube or dm cube? So since this initial formula, this formula is in cm cube, therefore the answer that you get is also in cm cube. Okay, immediately notice, oh, it's given cm cube, this put 20. Okay, so done. So this is about four to five marks in IGs. Thank you.